Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to do face deformation, LUD and skin smoothing. So I'm going to give you a link and you will need to download these three assets. After that, we are going to our Spark ER and we are creating a new project. It's going to be a blank project. And also those assets that we downloaded, we're going to drag them here into our assets panel. And before we begin, I decided to give um, a discount for my customized 3D eyelashes for my subscribers. These eyelashes, you will be able to change the length of them and color. And also this discount is just temporary. I will take it like at any moment. So if you like those, take advantage of this discount and use it for your filters. So now we are going to our lot. And here we're clicking no compression and also filtering. We are clicking or for none. Also, next step is add object and we are adding face mesh. And I'm going to call this face mesh retouch. And I'm adding material. Also, I'm going to call it retouch. And shader type is going to be retouching. And let's put 22. Next object I'm adding is rectangle. Also, I'm going to change to video of myself. So I'm a rectangle and canvas appeared automatically. And I'm changing the size of the rectangle, fill width and height. Okay, that's good. And also I'm adding material and I'm going to call it LUT background. I'm going to put BG. So, and also here, LUT background. Okay. And now we are going to view um, show height patch editor. And this patch was created by Maru Studio. I'm going to give you a link to this uh, creator in this description, in the description of this video. So if you like, uh, you can check out his videos and it's very convenient to use. So in order to apply our lot, first we need camera texture. So we're going to camera and we click texture extraction. And now we are dragging this texture extraction here and combine. Also, uh, don't forget to move your canvas above face tracker, by the way. And now we are going on our face tracker and also clicking on texture extraction. And here the texture appear, appeared. So we also dragging it to our patch editor and combining it. And the last thing is going to be a lot. So we are combining this lot. Now we need to um, find camera color. So camera color, basically our lot background. We are changing shader type to flat and clicking on texture and combining it. So now our background has the lab lot, but our skin smoothing disappeared. So I'm going to face tracker and adding one more mesh. And I'm going to call it lot skin. And I'm adding one more material. Lot skin. And it's going to be flat and also again clicking on texture to extract the texture and it appeared here. We are combining and now our skin smoothing works. And now we need to add our face deformation. Okay, so face mesh, deformation. And material, creating material, or actually, no, we're not creating material. We are picking material 
It's called LAT skin. So the last material from this face mesh, we're picking for this face mesh. So these two face meshes have the same material. And we are picking the formation. I'm clicking the formation. And uh, this one uh, I sell, uh, not I sell, I give for free. It's on my gum, uh, gum road. Uh, and this one I sell. So this one we're going to use because I want to show you how to work with eyes because face deformation and eyes can create some problems. So I'm going to open this one. And now we can see that our deformation happened. Eyes became bigger. But here's a problem. So first problem is this line. And we are going to our LUT skin, clicking on alpha and picking this face mesh mask to, to take away this line. Second problem is our eyes. So in order to fix that, we are going to our LUT skin and disable this eyes and mouth. Actually, yeah, better to disable. And going to the formation and also disable eyes and mouth. And also we are clicking on our LUT skin and going to advanced render options and disabling use depth test. And let's see how it looks. So now you can see for how my eyes are bigger, no smaller and lips are bigger. And you can play with opacity here to make the effect more intense or less intense. And remember uh, also about the discount code for the eyelashes. If you like them, use it now because later I'm going to take this code away. And have a good day. Thank you for watching my videos. Bye-bye.